Brian. Hello. Your brigandine is complete. I just thought I'd uh, send you a short video. See how I uh, did the closure and the problems that I had and why it took me so long. Um, it was kind of difficult to get the closure. Oh, let me see if I can move this camera down a little bit here and kind of show you. Alright. So, here we have the front, right? Or the back. Either way you want to wear it. Now, the main problem was that I didn't have your body to go by. So I had to make it larger on me, so it may dwarf me a little bit, because you're a big man. And uh, hopefully your big old melon head will fit through this hole here. Um, but as you can see, it's uh, here. I did the closure here. Now there's several parts to the closure. You can see that uh, you got all these antlers here that well, they kind of pierce through the leather and close it together. Um, and I had to use four in order to get a good pin up here, and pin here, and well, here in the center, and then one down here on the end to tie it all together. So, what the back looks like. Okay. So, let me take this thing off here. Now, as you can see here, I've got uh, on the edge here, I did like I said I was going to do, I did the braid of the copper wire all the way down there. Kind of gives a nice little finish to it. Alright. And, uh, and I figured since how one hand was your shield hand and one hand was your sword hand, it, well, they're kind of going to paint you different positions. Um, so that's why I kind of went with, because I didn't know which side you wanted in the front when fighting or which side in the back and more decorative and I don't know. Um, hopefully... You'll be able to try it on both ways to see which way, because I notice it kind of fits a little strange. So, but you do must realize that this is <laughs> this is my first brigandine to to complete here. So it took it took it took it took me a minute to get her all done. Um, now let's see the closure. Let's see if we can finagle this around here. The closure was kind of kind of tricky. I had to do this one first here. As you can see, I made a mistake right there. I had to restitch it. So, because, well, I made the buttonhole in the wrong angle. In other words, I made the buttonhole like this, and it, well, it should have been like that. So, that was where I did it. Now the funny thing was with this is to take all these things out here. It's hard to do this one handed hold the freaking camera. This button here. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Wow. Well, 
The problem I had with the closure was that when I had it pinned with just one, it moved back and forth up in here in the arm. Okay, so I had to get the one closure pinned before I could find uh, the angle on which to put this one and the, the horn over here and the horn up here because I had to had to pin it underneath the armpit these are all crucial points to pin it um, I had to pin it underneath the armpit had to pin it at the end had to pin it at the the end over there and then I had to pin it in the center so all crucial points so I had to have a four point uh, a four point uh, uh, latch there but anyway and uh, there you go bro there's your brigandine uh, I'll send it to you in the mail shortly along with a bill <laughs>